look what I found today. A set of magnets. I used to play with these when I was a child. But these magnets are old and are not as strong as they used to be. What happened to them? These magnets have lost their magnetic properties. See? They are not even attracted to each other. I think I know why these magnets aren't working well. Maybe they are demagnetized? But wait, is it possible for a magnet to lose its magnetic properties? How does this happen? Come on, let's find out. We know that a magnet is made up of many tiny magnet-like particles. And all these tiny magnets are facing in the same direction. Which means all their north poles point in one direction and all their south poles point in the opposite direction. But what happens if all of these particles change their direction and point to random directions? Well, when that happens, the magnet loses its magnetic properties. This is when we say the magnet is demagnetized. But this still doesn't answer the question. How was the magnet demagnetized? What can cause magnets to change the alignment of the tiny magnets within them? Actually, there are many ways in which a magnet can demagnetize. One of these reasons is heat. But how? When a magnet is heated, the tiny particles within it start vibrating at high speeds. This makes them change their alignment over time. But my magnets were never kept in a hot place. So what happened? Ah, a strong force can also harm a magnet. For example, if we hammer a magnet, it can break the alignment of the particles. Eventually, this demagnetizes the magnet. Time can also affect the life of magnets. As time passes, if magnets are not maintained and stored properly, they might get demagnetized. Sometimes, if a magnet falls, there is a high chance that they will get demagnetized. Whoa, there are so many things to be careful of. What can we do to properly store and take care of magnets? Let us look at the ways magnets can be kept safe from becoming demagnetized. Mm, where is it? Ah, there it is. A wooden box. Finally, we have a safe place to keep them. This looks like the perfect container to store my magnets. This box has a wooden piece and two metal strips in it. We should keep these bar magnets in pairs and separate them by placing a wood piece in between them. Ensure that the unlike poles are pointing in the same direction. Then, we should place these magnetic keepers at the ends. A magnetic keeper is a soft iron or steel metal piece that joins the two ends of different magnets while storing them. But how do we store horseshoe magnets? Both of the magnetic poles point in the same direction. The solution is simple. We just have to place magnetic keepers at the poles. That's all it takes. Now we know that I should not have stored these magnets in the metal box. I will store these new magnets properly. Why don't you try storing your magnets in these ways? And remember, we stay curious.